kill Superman. And if they had to do it all again. And four years of pre-med, four years of med school, and tons of unpaid loans have made me realize one thing. Good. Could you go drop an NG tube on the patient in 234 and call the attending that the lavage is positive? I don't know, Jack. Look, I became a doctor because I wanted to help people. But orientation yesterday? It didn't really focus on patient care. The hospital doesn't want to be sued. Being sued is not a good thing. Hey, how was, uh, how was patient? Oh, first day, Bambi. Yeah. Carla, we'll take care of you. Don't look at me when we're moving somewhere. Why? We're waiting for Dr. Cuts. Hi, doctor. I'm placing Ivy for me. We'll talk later. Come on, you've done this to cadavers before, so this guy's alive. Just poke it through his skin. Poke it through, now! Time's up. Carla, would you do it for him, please? I'm also gonna need an ABG. It's just that this isn't really what I expected, you know? Most of my patients are, uh, older and sort of checked out mentally. Pumpkin, that's modern medicine. Advances that keep people alive who should have died a long time ago, back when they lost what made them people. Now your job is to stay sane enough so that when someone does come in that you actually can help, you're not so brain dead that you can't function. You see, surgical interns, they're all slice them and dice them. They're the jocks. Medical interns, we're trained to think about the body, diagnose, test. So what's it like being a young and hot shot doctor? It's like, did you ever go see a movie that everyone told you was great, and then because of all those expectations, you ended up totally disappointed? Movies nowadays have too many special effects. Yeah, that was pretty much my point. You're worried about being on call tonight, aren't you? Yeah. Look, worst case scenario, you kill somebody, and that hangs over your head the rest of your life. But that is the absolute worst case scenario. <laughs> Forgive me if I act a little strange For I know not what I do Feels like lightning running through my veins Every time I look at you Bambi, come on, let's go Every time I look at you Check on you every 10 minutes, Mrs. Marino, okay? I need to see you in Mr. Bursky's room. He crashed. Anyhow, you have to pronounce him. I'll never forget that moment. The way he looked exactly the same, only completely different. Time of death, 0200. I just wanted to help people. The hardest part is how quickly you have to move on. So I guess that's it for now. 31 hours, 12 minutes, and I am... You finally off? You see, I can't survive on my own. Even now, when I finally get to go home, in the back of my head, I'll know the hospital's still here, wide awake. Bambi, get out while you still can. But what the hell? The most important thing is that I got through my first three days without looking like a complete idiot.